What's up YouTube? Caleb here and you are watching AZ Legend Adventures. Alright, today we're going to be working on a quad trailer. We're going to turn the simple quad, quad trailer, trailer right here. and we're going to turn it into a kayak trailer. We're going to be able to put the uh, kayaks right on top, so it's going to be nice. Uh, here in Cottonwood where I live, egg kayaking is like a huge thing now. Everyone is driving around the kayak on it. So if you uh, have a trailer or anything like that, you're really into kayaking, you need a way to load it up instead of throwing it on top of your car, whatnot, you can easily convert one of these into a kayak trailer. And today we're going to do it and I'll show you the way I'm going to do mine. Alright, some materials needed. Uh, I got two shallow super strut bars. Just got those at Home Depot in the electrical department. Right there. And they're a little bit long, so I'm going to have to cut them down. And I got me four four-inch uh, sewage pipes. And I checked them out. Uh, you, can, you can go heavier or whatnot, but I think this is going to be, this is going to do just fine. If they crack or whatever, these are pretty cheap. I can replace them easily. And last thing, just make sure you get all your nuts and bolts. I went to Ace Hardware already and kind of just got them all and already kind of put them together. Got a little marker just to mark some spots so I can see what's going on. All right, first up, I'm going to start by putting the struts straight across right here. I'm gonna just get a, make sure it's nice and even. Nice part about this build is you can take it apart quickly, so if I need to revert it back to a kayak, or a, revert it back to a quad trailer, easy to do. solid now they're not going to come off. Uh, next I'm going to use my pipe here. I'm going to start putting these on. I'm going to put a bigger hole at the top uh, using a one inch drill bit and at the bottom I'm going to go smaller to the three eighths that I use for my bolt. So it's going to be one here so I can put my socket all the way through and I can tie it on really good okay. Alright so that's the next. So let's drill two holes. I got to make sure they're lined up. You don't want to get them crooked either. It's not mess up. <laughs> done got them all on there they're bolted down nice and sturdy on there all right so next up we're gonna have to put some eyeballs to hold it down put these bad boys on there all right Ooh, and don't forget a lock washer at the bottom or a lock nut now time to cut off the And here is the final project, all done, strapped on, it's down very, very tight. We got it here and it's solid. It shakes a little, but it's not going anywhere. I tested it down the road. And that's it. That's how you build a DUI kayak trailer. Now we are off to Lee's Ferry and here we go.